Welcome back to Metal Gear uh, Peace Walker Recollection. It is the episode. Metal Gear hey. Recollection. Don't care. It's the same shit. Peace People Walker. People still understand me. Episode 9. This is 9. nine? Episode 9. Oh, well, nine shit, I was off. God damn it. I did it again. Yeah, you did. Piss and shit. Piss, shit, fuck ass. Oh. Hey, don't forget to show off a... Uh, the thing you were gonna show up. This is devolving. What was the thing I was gonna? Sh- what was the thing I was gonna show? What do you want the me to curry, show? What it looks like. And oh show. yeah, I guess I could. I guess I could show that right now before an epic boss battery. Oh! <laughs> okay, I'm done. I'm <laughs> done with it. We shall see. I'm done. Aru- oh! Oh! God damn! Fucking son of a bitch! I'm so ass at. There's a lot of guys Ass. in here. Huh? There's a lot of guys in here. Some so, names, unfortunately, we're going to have to begin this episode with a little bit of house cleaning. Basically, I've got more guys than I can than I can deal with right now. Uh, so I need to put them into uh, wherever they're good, such as the intel team and stuff. You can see by the letter grades on the other side. Yes. And then remove people who are worse than them, or just remove the the most worst people on any given team. So if you see right now, I've got 52 people out of 50 in my thing. So just go down here and just grab the last two guys and discharge them. Fired. He screams it. He screams, you're fired. Ocelot. Liquid. Liquid. What the One, fuck two, is that three, noise? Four, five, six. Oh, are you having problems with your audio? No, no, no. A plane just took off. You're oh. Fired. I'll take off your plane. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So speaking of mass transit, I had something interesting I wanted to bring up with you, and it's not related to the LP at all. But oh, yeah. basically, we were talking. Hey, look! I can develop a law. I, I almost did a it. Law? I stopped myself. Hey. Yeah. Um, you said you can't get anywhere because stuff, and I was like, nah. -uh. And now I forgot what I was talking about. Hey, look! This is curry. You can bring curry on missions. There's the curry, oh. and then you've got the great curry. Yeah, girl. Oh. And then you've got the future curry. And it's extra spicy, 95% fat-free. You got these fucking tortilla chips. Yeah. They look like Doritos. These are supposed to be Doritos. In the in the not this version, these were Doritos. Uh, so Snake developed Doritos. He also developed 4X X4 lime flavor lime soda. Is that supposed to be Sprite? Zero calorie soda. Uh, and then Cologne, which was Axe body spray in a previous version as well. So, Big Boss and his merry band of man lovers, I'm, yeah, uh, developed Axe Body Spray and Doritos. This is a really flaccid way to start an LP. <laughs> I blame you. Blame me, Aru. Oh. <laughs> oh. This is like, this is like the point where it's like, eh, Thank fuck it, I'll just... Pour all my water all over my power transformers for my laptops and just end it all. <laughs> just end it all. All right, so we're going into this here. I don't have the battle suit yet, do I? Nope. So let's equip. Don't have battle dress. Explosives. Do you have? Uh, yeah, you do. You have the curry and the chips and the ration. I do. I really wish I had the, uh, the, the aerial mines. This fight is a motherfucker. It's trivialized when you grind, when you do grinding on it later because you get a mine that's just an aerial mine, which is just basically a landmine that floats in midair, and the thing mm. will fly into it and take massive damage. But well, we don't... don't... you have, um... um... <coughs> you know what I didn't bring? Or did I? Chaff grenades? Did I have chaff grenades? Because if I don't, I'm fucked. <laughs> uh, let's take a quick look. So... Nope, yeah. no chaff grenades. No chaff grenades. No chaff grenades. Okay, so I want to hit the radome on this damn thing. 
Okay, yeah. do you see that? Do you see how it did the fucking... The air thing? And now my yeah. missile's just flying around in fucking circles? Hey, look, I hit it. Um, that's... You're gonna see a lot of that. A lot of missiles flying around in circles and that thing doing sick air jukes. Fucking infuriating. Oh, there, that one missed it now, too. Hit it! God damn. So this battle, thanks for thanks for speaking and keeping up your end of the LP, Tony. Shut your mouth. Yeah, I got the ray dome. Good. Uh, you, you, you need the ray dome. Oh shit, I'm out of ammunition. Shit. Oh, he moved away before I could get a beat on him again. You need the ray dome for what? You need the ray dome for Metal Gear Zeke later on. So I'm gonna do my very best to beat it up. To beat the you pussy need up. it? Need it? Yes, it's a required part for building it. Actually, no. Is it a required part? I don't remember. But I'm also going to look around here because if I remember correctly, there's uh, uh, huh. there's like a document or something in the area. You sure? Because it's not like last time. I'm vaguely positive. Oh, God. And I missed him. Great. Great. LP is Great. off to a, a beautiful start. Beautiful, beautiful bupin. Here it comes. Here it comes. Got Boom. dead ass. And I got his railgun, too. You need the railgun and the radome off of this guy. Uh, both are optional parts for Zeke. And that's important. Okay, so I don't remember if I said it because I don't know if I've been using words the entire time I've been doing this. But um, not only do you have to fight this guy, but he sends out little snatchers that'll snatch you up and eat you. The kidnappers. The little, yeah, the little UAV things, like the yeah. one that that grabbed Amandan. <laughs> Amandan Hagen gas. Okay. Um, okay. But his railgun is a fucking beast. His railgun mm. is trouble. Right so now, he's speaking in Miku's voice and saying, "Jane." He's not doing much, or I should say, it is not doing much. Let's yeah. not let's not characterize this with with words. It doesn't with have words. Genders. Well, I mean, the voice of the voice audio is clearly female. Female. Family. <laughs> Did I get it? Yeah. <coughs> so just yeah. like... Did I not get any RPG in the Woo! Oh, there it is. Oh, no, it's got like a... a, a ginger... Oh! Oh, God! Oh, Ow. my God. Owie. Okay, there's Come the snatchers. They're coming to touch me, Tony. They want to touch you. If I can take out that railgun, that'll go a long way towards. It looks like I've already taken out the damn radome on the damn thing. The, the things are good. They're coming. Yeah, I'm stuck on a wall. Oh. Oh, oh no! Mash. Oh, sorry, there we go. At you. Um, I started mashing ahead. before the prompt came up, so it was like, okay, it's probably Woo. fine. Yeah, I've already taken out shit. I've already taken out the radome and the chain gun on the damn. The radome and the the railgun. Railgun, thank you. You're welcome. Oh God, yes. I missed dead ass. God damn it, man. This is why I don't play baseballs. <laughs> this is why I don't play basketball. Oh man, have you ever actually tried to play basket shit? <laughs> no. Have you ever tried to actually play basket shit? Mm, yes, I shit in the basket all the time. Oh no. That is the opposite of what I was trying to ax you about. Ax me? Yes. I hate that. I'm trying to ax you some body spray. Hey, you hit it. Alright, so let's see. Railgun and Raydome are the big pieces to get off of this. And then after that, just going for the, uh, the fly-y parties. God damn. I am in can trouble you not go here. For the head? Yes, can you can. Actually, oh. shooting at the AI pod is a really good way to do a ton of damage to this thing. Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, Did I get oh, my rocket off? No, I did not. Uh, hitting the AI pod is a great way to do a ton of damage to these things, but you damage it so fast that you don't get any uh, any of the AI pieces. Okay. Oh, God. I'm getting fucked up tremendously. <laughs> Whoa. Bro. I think I'm down to my last rocket again. Throw that marker down. See, eventually you get eventually you get a suit that gives you um go, go, go. Is it like a sneaking suit where it does like it, it reduces damage? No, it, Ah shit, I didn't do that nearly well enough. 
LP canceled, fuck it. No. Okay. Eventually you get a suit that gives you three weapon slots so you can carry three different types of missile launchers, which helps tremendously towards these boss fights and the big uh, vehicle boss fights. Mm. But, uh... Clearly I'm not having as much luck with, uh, with that. Boom. Yeah, but this dead. actually, yeah. I think taking out the Ray Dome right away helped it with the, the whole head slip thing missiles. that it does. Kind of missiles. So the fact that it's not head slipping is going a long way towards us being able to, to, to do this boss fight. So the smoke means you're taking out those parts, right? Uh, more or less. Like, you can see they're physically destroyed when you actually look at the, uh, the, the, the thing. Okay, so now I've blown him up, and now instead of him just blowing up, he's going to come down here... Right singing so oops familiar. i guess i died and then he's gonna sing uh gangnam style informative lp that's not gangnam shut up i know you're a fat anyways no now he comes down here so you can do the ai pod thing like you've done with every other one <laughs> he's lazy to the side he just lays down he's very sad um, there's an optional tape you can grab in this one. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's, uh, it, it took me months to figure it out, because I'm an uh -huh. idiot. Uh-huh. Um, but yeah, it's in here. <coughs> Good little coffee coup there. Coffee mm -hmm. waffy. Delicious. Coffee is delicious. I love coffee. Okay, let's grab this shit. Oh, I didn't damage too much of it. I should be able to grab everything. Should be able to garb Irvatarn her. Yeah, <clears throat> what's the optional piece? Um, it's over on the other side. I'll get to it, but it'll be like right at the end. Oh, okay. No. Um, but uh, you can grind these, all these guys for for the specific parts of the of the uh, the Metal Gear body. Uh huh. Um, and then obviously the the AI boards, like the ones I'm pulling out here, you can grind these for as well. Um, it doesn't have a lot uh, of parts. The optional parts. Oh, it wasn't there. It must be later on. Well, it does. I just didn't damage enough stuff to get them all. Oh, okay. So now here's 14 seconds of dead silence. That's I just so, muted my mic. That's so that's bad. All I did. That's all I did. I like, that is an LP ruining moment there. Meh. I'm really sorry. I could have made a like fart joke. I could have done anything. But yeah, instead... Yeah, like burp. Yeah. Oh, man. I'm flummy today. I'm sorry. Yeah. I had some of my leftover delicious white chicken chili for breakfast with some uh, mm. jalapeno Doritos. Invented by Militaire Sans Frontier. Or Snake. Well, that's, ah! that's the outfit. It's Militaire Sans Frontier. Mm -hmm. Military is without borders. Yay, Fucking I level French. up my FIM 43. I think the lock on time gets reduced when you level up the uh, uh, guided rockets. Hey, look. God damn it, doesn't need it. Carl Gustav. Hey! Carl Gustav. It's actually oh, really, really I heard good. It's a really good one. It does it does a ton of damage and the the flight speed is Play super me fast. Like Forget about it. You'll Play me like a piano. He played us like a goddamn fiddle. All right then. I confirmed the location. Who played us like a fiddle? Referring to another thing in the upcoming oh. here. I'm sorry. That was gross. <laughs> It tasted like chocolate and chili. Oh. Chocolate chili. That sounds fucking horrible. Yeah, it does. When I was in, like, culinary school. A yeah, a decade ago now. When I was in culinary school. God damn, a decade ago. Um, yeah. How old are you? I'm 29. But when I was in culinary school a decade ago. Um, yeah. We had a bunch of friends. Basically, they didn't have enough dorms, so they rented out, like, crack houses to put people in. And uh, <laughs> hostels and shit. 
Fuck and me and my wife, girlfriend at the time, were living in one of the crack houses, and we moved out. But down the block was one of the hostels that our buddies were uh, put up in. Yeah. And they had a big kitchen over there. So we're like, okay, cool. We'll go over there and do, like, breakfast and stuff, you know, because we're able to cook. So, um... Uh, where was I going with this? Oh, yeah. So I made breakfast for these guys one time, and they really, really liked the eggs I made. Um, and so, you know, that was nice and all. But then they re tried to recreate it, and apparently one of them thought that I had put chocolate in the eggs. Ew. <laughs> so he made eggs for him and his roommate with chocolate in the eggs. And apparently it was the worst fucking thing ever. I, I didn't try any of it. I just got a call, like, apparently right after they started eating it, like, Oh! God! <laughs> right? Yeah. So, yeah, that's the end of that story. That's a terrible story. I'm sorry I told it that way. So, what's happening right now is we're talking about... We're talking about Snake. And we're talking about his motivations, and he's still very much motivated by his connection to the boss. Like, Kaza said, you left behind everything, but that's like the one thread that's keeping you, that's holding you down, basically. It's the one thing that's keeping you from flying. I realized something. That debriefing I heard could have been part of the cover story. That debriefing I heard could have been part of the cover story. So see, he's having delusions of grandeur relating to the boss and her last mission and everything. And that a lot of this game goes into that and goes into Snake basically coming to terms with her death. Which I think is what the chasing butterflies metaphor is really, really about here. I took on this mission for a kid. Yeah. It's pretty... So, go ahead. What the hell is the chasing butterflies thing? It's... It, it's the, the... 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 It's a running theme throughout here. Yeah, but what does it mean? There's, what is the metaphor for? It's... I think it's a metaphor for him try Or er, for him chasing after this idealistic view of the boss. So he's trying to be like the boss. That's why he's chasing butterflies? He's try. He's not trying to be like the boss. He's tr He's trying to... He's trying to... He's coming to terms with her death by denying it he's in a state of denial and okay. he's left behind like clearly he's off that he's off the fucking reservation he, mm. he's not you know he's not associated with the united states anymore he's running a private military company you know completely off the grid in south america cg rank two but yeah he's running a thing completely off the off the grid but he's still he still can't give up the boss and so this this game in a lot of ways is him coming to terms with her last mission and so we'll get to see a lot of that here okay so now I almost have a completely fully full up ass shit so now we need to start seriously removing bros uh, which we're gonna see a lot here, and I'm gonna try and do as much of it off camera as possible. Get rid of Bengal Vulture and Centipede here. No, not Centipede. But we have Fired. to because they they won't let us do anything. Really? Yeah, they won't let us do anything if we're overstaffed in any way whatsoever. All right, so let's build the Carl Gustav. And let's do. Let's see. Do I have anything new to build here? No, I do not. So let's go on with another mission new. Because we've gone through the big plot dump here, and now we're now we're working our way to the next uh, next big thing. And hey, now we start to see strange love. So now we have to travel to the mine base. We're probably going to get into a ridiculous boss fight at some point, I would assume. Yeah. With another flying AI weapon. Oh, is it another flying one? No, there's not another flying one. I'm just. I mean, it's Same. it's kind of it's kind of totally bonkers. In fact, not even kind of. It's totally fucking bonkers. I mean, do you not agree? The boss? Mm -mm. The boss fight or the, the this whole mission? Everything about the game. AI in the 70s, flying yeah. AI <laughs> weapons, rail guns yeah. in the 70s. It's all ridiculous. But hey, chapter 3. So we had actually finished chapter 2 with that previous thing. Oh well. Yay. Hooray. 
Hey, look, I'm riding What's a horsey. Horse How's the horse? Clip. Not too bad. You never know he was over to over to Whoa! Damn! It's the boss's horse. That's kind of completely ridiculous. Is it the same horse that's in V? Uh, no. Okay. No, no fucking way. That horse would be like 40 years old at that point. I'm pretty sure horses don't get that old. Right. No. God damn it. Sure they, I'm sure they barely get to 20. Yeah, I don't remember. I spent a year. I spent a year on a horse ranch, um, doing horse shit. Ha <laughs> ha! You stuck your dick in horse shit. No. Although I did have to muck stalls, and that was fucking terrible. For anybody who's ever mucked a stall, I feel your pain. I had to do every Friday like 70 fucking horse stalls. It was terrible. No. It took um, the entire Friday, and it just smelled like ammonia death forever. Horses live between 25 and 30 years. Oh, my. So, I think I might have seen like one horse die the entire time I was there. Oh. Uh. So, it's sad. I'm not an expert. Oh, look at these guys. They're just hanging out. No, don't don't mind the dude that's on the fucking roof. No, it's fine. They can't see me. Shut up. Are there any guys back here? You can't be imagining things. Well, clearly you are imagining things because there's nobody here and you fuckaroos are a... God damn it! Fuckaroos. I'm fuckaroos. really bad at this. <laughs> I'm really bad at this. We take chicken. So, it's... Yeah, pretty much. <clears throat> So, I don't understand, I don't understand how they put out, uh, weapons and shit in this game. And what I, or, not weapons, but drops and shit in this game. Because they, Wait, shit, what's going on? they give you drops. not fucking sleep? No, he's, he's gonna be out now. And this guy's gonna be down here. Ba -ba. There we go. So, I don't understand how they do drops in this game, or, or, uh, uh, item placements. Because normally, by the time you get through an entire area, you barely need any weapons. I mean, look, I've gone through so many of these, and I've barely ever needed a resupply, except for the big-ass boss fights. Mm -hmm. And your 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 tech guys, they, they, they make items for you. They develop items. So you uh -huh. never really need to pick any up out in the wild, and yet there's, like, anesthetics all over the place. But I've never gone through, I've never gone through an entire thing. I think I, I might have done it once or twice. That's interesting. So I don't understand that. It's always kind of bothered me about that game. Or uh, about this game, excuse me. What? Is there a higher difficulty? Uh, I don't think so. Not, no, there isn't. Oh, okay. No, there's not really a difficulty setting for this, uh, for this game. It's not like where you unlock some hard mode missions later for, uh, uh-oh. Oh, how did I... Oh, God. Hot! Oh. <laughs> Hit the wood. Hot, dude. dog -a -doo. He's got a roo. He's got an M60. I also said oh. hot, too. Let's see anybody over there. Yep. Fuck him up. I'm trying... There we go. I'm trying to look like a cool guy. Here. Let's bang on the thing. You did hear something. Get your booty over who. Hot doof, doggeroo. Mm -hmm. <laughs> shut up. You're you not my dad. Up. You were right. I'm gonna get that ass! Oh, snap! So, if you want to knock out a guy really fast in this guy, shoot him once and then body slam him. Go west, snake. Go west, mm -hmm. snake. West. Fuck you. West. Westeroos. See what I did there? Steros. Yes. Steros. Da 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 da. One snake next to, next another. to another. We ner. Fucking Wiener. goddamn. Oh damn it! <laughs> now that's I got gonna be you in my head. head. You fucking fuck. Fuck you. <laughs> Piece of shit. You bring it on, big guy. <laughs> yes, yeah. I did it. Okay. I think there's a confidential document up here, but I'm probably totally wrong. Oh no, there's an item over there. All right, let's see. Can I do it again? Probably yes, I can. A machine gun. What is this? It's a Fulton. God damn! I don't need that. I went through all that trouble. Shit! Shit is stupid. You're stupid. Thirty-one. Thirty-one. There's the thirty-one there. <laughs> 
There was a 31 on the building. What? Hey. Oh, shit. Is that okay, a boss? Okay, so I'm going into this mining pit. That's Peace Walker. Oh, shit. That's a boss. That's Peace Walker. Oh, shit. It's peace walking all over the place. It's almost like moonwalking, except you don't turn white after 40 years. <laughs> Shut up. No. Bad. Wu-Tang. Look at that thing. The thing actually looks kind of cool. It looks like a Metal Gear. Eh. Looks Finally, like a Metal Gear that looks like a Metal Gear. Oh, no! Oh, oh. shit! Brett! Shoot it! <laughs> Snake is so, like, sluggish and slow and stupid here. No, so this is a, oh, sniper. this is a legitimate sniper fight. This one's actually really, really tough because they go for headshots and it hurts. Oh shit! <clears throat> yeah, this is actually a really I, 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 a frustrating, I guess is the word, mission yeah. coming up here. But we're gonna yeah. do it really quick. We've got enough time. In fact, okay. we're, we're not even gonna worry about dude bros in the waiting room or anything. We're just gonna go straight to it. Hey, we got an A. Let's hope you have uh, A for that ass. Following stage can now be selected in versus cops. You wouldn't be overstaffed, would you? Miners Rastafarian. I'm extremely overstaffed. So. But having people in the waiting room does not really count. Oh, okay. Not really. Look at that wrinkly old fuck. There's a picture of you. You shut up. You're right. Uh, you're wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Eliminate the enemy guards to clear the way for the infiltration of the mine base. It. Let's do it. You've been spotted by the guards. Take, take them out off. before they take you out. It's very straightforward. No, really? It's like the writing in Halo 2. Yeah. <laughs> Start machine. Make sandwich. All right, I've got Old Mark 22, X. Mosin Nagant. Uh, let's get rid of the Mark 22. And let's equip a heavy machine gun. Let's equip the PKM for the uh, the floaty bossy guys. Mm. And let's try and extract as many dudes as possible, because I'm pretty sure these dudes are good dudes. Dude, bro, dude, dudes. Dude, dog. Dick. Dick. Oh. Oh. Got a couple. Do it for the fun. I ain't gonna do it. All right, we've do already seen this, so I'm just gonna really it. skip it really quick. All right. Do it for the dick. I ain't what? What are you talking about? Nothing. Do it for her. Do it for the boss. There's no turning back now, Snake. The Watch boss. The, enemy. Move on. the joy. Oh, here's the zoom. Oh shit! Look at look at how shaky this shit is over that distance. It's almost like real life. It is fucking unacceptable. I got him in the hand. Oh, he shot me. Shit. Uh, shit. Pa. Okay, there's hey, one guy down. Him. Okay, now this guy needs to get taken out. Ah! Okay, that was fast. So these guys, these guys will fucking sneak up on you quick if you're not careful. Well, yeah. Can you set up like traps and shit? Uh, there he is. I mean, you Here could. Shit. Well, that didn't work. YouTube has detected that your video may be shaky. Would you like us <laughs> to fix it? <laughs> Have you gotten that yet? Uploading any videos? Yeah. The YouTube shaky. There's some videos. Oh yeah. Well, those are shaky on purpose because you're holding a weapon. Come here, a asshole. Weapon. Yeah, ah. right in the face. Oh. That's, oh shit! Run. That's a man. It's a man's uh, butt. Where is he? There he is. There he is. He. Ha. Um. When you level up your weapons, the shaking goes. Oh, there's men. When you there level up your weapons, the shaking goes down. That should be a skill thing, not a weapons thing. Well, it is, because you gain skill with the weapon. Hmm. So, are you upgrading Snake, or are you upgrading the rifle? You're upgrading Snakeeru. Do de de do do de de do. God damn it! More dudes! Fuck. Holy shit! Yeah, look at all those snipers. They're pissed off at me. And there's they little old me. What? Clearly. Yeah. Shit. Yeah. The father of modern sniping. Holy shit, here they come. Like, they're snipers. Shouldn't they just, like, be sniping instead of, like, running at me? They shoot him with the pistol. Oh, they have, uh... Oh, those aren't sniper rifles. That's a sniper rifle. Uh-oh. Oh, shit! I'm being fired upon by men. Okay. 
and machines. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh, really oh, 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 he's got my goodies. Oh, 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 god! Oh shit! Where is he? 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 Where the fuck? Oh, there he is. Fuck no, no, you! No, 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 no. More dudes. I want to capture some of these fucking guys. Okay, he's near death, so we can grab him. Yay, I've got one. <laughs> what about the other two that you put to sleep? There's a sniper somewhere. Um, since this is a boss battle, they go into a sleep death state, I guess is a way to word oh, it. Oh, so they disappear. Yeah, they, oh, he's got a rocket, and he got pushed out by his flans. Did you see? Mm-hmm. Better run. Nope. I got this. I got, oh, I got, yeah! Damn. Fuck Get your shot. couch! Oh, of course he would get up the moment I got Boom. him in the face. Face first. Oh wow, I'm actually getting Headshot. rather good at dealing with this horrible shaky cam. Bullshit. Oh! See, look, did you see how he had the blue skull and then he died? Yeah. And I'm dead. Oh, so did you. Oh. What a oh. placid way to end the episode. Next time, yeah, no shit. Next time on... Two Back best busy. friends grump. <laughs> Fuck. Two best friends grump a flyer. Thanks for watching. We'll catch you next time on the Recorrection. Bye.